In this video, we're going to learn how to remotely access a device in GoToResolve. This feature will allow you to remotely view or control computers or servers without an end user present. To begin, click on the Devices icon on the left hand side of your GoToResolve console. Here, you will see a list of your previously added devices. Choose the computer you would like to remotely access. If you are trying to access a server, it must be in console mode to use this feature. You have two ways of connecting a remote session. If you hover over the device, you can click on the arrow icon, or click on the device and choose Start Remote Control. Here you will be asked to enter your signature key to ensure your endpoint is protected. Once entered, click Proceed. Note, if you have not set up your signature key, you'll be prompted to do so. You will be brought to the Starting Remote Support Session page. If in the GoToResolve free tier, the session will be an attended session, meaning someone on the other end must grant you permission to control the device. If that is the case, you will see the message that you are waiting to control the device. The person on the other end will receive a chat box that pops up along with a window to grant permission. They will need to click Let's Start to allow you access. You will also be able to chat or send attachments from the chat window if needed. This chat also timestamps when you connect and disconnect with the device. Once you are granted access, you will have the option to connect now. If you are in a paid tier, you have full unattended access. You will be prompted with the connect now option and immediately be brought to the computer desktop or server, just as if you are sitting in front of it. Now that you are in a remote session, you will see your in-session toolbar at the top of your screen for access to options like reboot the remote device, share files between devices, share your screen, turn on blank screen for privacy, check computer information like CPU, memory usage, and system info, and more. Once you're finished, you can click end session. You are now ready to use GoToResolve's unattended or attended remote access feature. For more information, please visit support.goto.com forward slash resolve.